This is YSM Sports Media. I want to thank you for all your love and support. Really appreciate it. We wouldn't be able to do this without you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now and click the notification button for all future content. This is Thug T. Breezy for YSM Sports Media. The Cardinals, DeAndre Hopkins, and my man Kyler Murray just had to play of the year. Down by four with 10 seconds left. They throw a Hail Mary. DeAndre Hopkins jumps over three guys and catches it, and they win. Right, so Cliff Kingsbury is a great coach. My vote for Coach of the Year right now at the midseason point is Brian Flores. He got the Dolphins six and three. Tua got two wins in a row. Dolphins won five games in a row. They gutted that roster, liquidated their assets, got rid of Minka Fitzpatrick and a whole bunch of other guys. But them young guys can play. And Fitzpatrick is a black guy. I mean, Brian Flores is a black guy from Bill Belichick's coaching tree that took the Dolphins and they about to make the playoffs. They six and three. They got Tua and Fitzpatrick's a great backup. He had him winning, but Tua's out there balling. Good running game, great young defense, great coach, and a great scheme. But Cliff Kingsbury with the Arizona Cardinals, Kyler Murray just set the record for most games with a pass TD and a rush TD consecutively in NFL history. Eight games in a row, five straight games of rush TDs at quarterback, and he's five ten. They said he was too little. They said he was black quarterbacks that come from that system won't do nothing in the NFL. It's proving everybody wrong. The Cardinals and Kyler Murray are for real. The Bills played great, too. They're just bad against the pass vertically. For some reason, their corners and their safeties give up the deep ball. But 7-3 and three is a good record for the Bills. Don't sleep on the Pats. I say they're going to win like five or six in a row if everybody stay healthy because Cam Newton got the rhythm of the offense down and a little bit of continuity with his receivers and they can run the ball. And Shoney Michelle was hurt. But Brian Flores, great young coach, coach of the year in my opinion. Even if the Dolphins, if you don't win, the, win another game the whole year, six wins with that Dolphins roster is brilliant. But as you will see, Kyler Murray and DeAndre Hopkins made the play today. Hell Mary with 10 seconds left. It was 30 to 25, I think, or and they scored a touchdown to win the game. He jumped over three guys. So the Texans, dumb as hell, traded him for some fucking racist bullshit for fucking a decent running back and some draft picks, the best receiver in the game, arguably, and that's Kyler Murray's fucking safety valve. The Cardinals, 6-3. and Because Kingsbury, great offensive mind. Off that Mike Leach, air raid, spread system, coaching trip, where, you know, four or five wide sets, he comes to Mike Leach's. He played for Texas Tech. He was a great college quarterback. Slung that rock and my, when Mike Leach was the coach. So, you know, he made, he made the air raid. So, on um, the offenses you've seen in college, five wide sets, four wide sets, a lot of uh, quick screens. That supplements the run game. And um, the running backs are real involved in the passing game. Getting five out on the route that came from Mike Leach. You know, with... Um, dual read pass protection from the running back like he'll read the strong side Sam and then and then the corner if he blitzes so they'll still have six guys to protect but he'll release through his protection sometimes they'll bring a receiver in in the box and have him release through his protection too like a tall receiver so but it's just stuck out T Breezy for YSM Sports Media my man Kyler Murray like I said he's going to pass four 4,800 yards and rush 4,000 yards this year. He might break the quarterback rushing record this year. He's definitely going to break the quarterback TD record. He's going to have 20 rushing. Brian Flores, coach of the year. More black coaches got to get a chance to take positions of power and positions of authority and positions of head coach. Brian Flores, not even, I think he's 39. Great young coach, Miami Dolphins, 6-3. and three. My Eagles suck. It's Thugged Out T-Breeze. He still is 8-0. YSM Sports Media. Yeah.